Welcome to New England in October. Holy cow. It's not even Halloween yet. And look at this. Look at all the snow on my barn. Look at that. And look at the hydrangeas, those poor babies. Oh my gosh, they are literally weighted down by this unexpected snowstorm. You know, it got me thinking, what do you do when an unexpected storm hits? Well, number one, there's no use about it or resisting it because it's here. And um, you got no control over the fact that it's here. So number two, if there is a big pile of snow or you know what, that the storm has created, just shovel the pile in front of you and move on. Number three, since it's here, why not figure out how to hunker down and take care of yourself? Why not figure out a way that you can be kind to yourself and nurture yourself as you weather this storm? For me, that means lighting a fire, pulling my gravity blanket over me, sitting down, reading a book, not going anywhere. Not that I was going to go anywhere in a pandemic anyway, but just really knowing that this storm will pass. I might as well just enjoy the snow day. Um, and that's the final thing. This is temporary. This is going to pass. Hell, it's going to be 60 degrees here in a couple days, so I'm not even going to bother cleaning this up or trying to shovel it because it's all going to melt away. And whatever storm you're facing in your life, it's going to pass too. It is kind of beautiful. And so are you. We'll get through this, I promise. Hey, it's Mel. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't already subscribed, please, please, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you like this video, I have a suspicion you're going to like these two next.